What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of NFT Alpha. It's your boy Taco here. Let's get right into today's video with a Board Ape Yacht Club announcement. That is right, Forge on ahead. The Heavy Metal Forge is now live. So this was live on June 29th, about six days ago. And let's jump right into, you know, their little explainer telling us how to play the game. Heavy Metal Forge, build, flex, fight, evolve. Heavy Metal Forge is now live. Your mission, help your heavy metal unlock its next evolution. Your heavy metal is relying on you to get rare upgrades and evolve into an Evo 2. You'll be doing this by keeping your heavy metal happy while building the ultimate forge as voted on by discerning Dejan, your fellow heavy metal holders. Before we dive into specifics, take a minute to watch the gameplay trailer below. I want to know when we get to fighting this guy. So your Heavy Metal Forge, what do you need to know? Heavy Metal Forge is a game that starts as a casual world builder and pet game and ends as a competitive dungeon crawler. Originally summoned as mysterious little cubes called power sources, the Heavy Metals of the Heavy Metal Collection are now in their Evolution 1 state. Your HV, I've been calling it heavy, is relying on you to earn up to six powerful upgrades for your Evo 2 form. At least three of these powerful upgrades, known as amps, will be needed for your heavy to reach its Evo 2 state. And any HV that participates in a season, regardless of rank, will earn an amp. Daily voting by other heavy metal holders will determine your seasonal leaderboard ranking. The seasonal ranking will ultimately decide the rarity of your amp you earn. Heavy Metal Forge will last for six seasons, giving players six chances at upgrades. Once the third season comes to a close, heavies will require energy to be able to enter the rift. Before you ape into the forge, make sure to review the game guide and FAQ released earlier this week for all the details on how to care for and build your heavy metal. If you don't like reading, here's a, another video for you. A video in a video. It's videoception. Let's walk through everything you'll need to know to build the forge of your dream. When you connect your wallet to the site, any heavy you own or have been delegated will show up. Each heavy has its own unique forge. You can build and you can craft, you can make tiles, you can put the tiles wherever you want. You hit this nice red button that says push and it creates different tiles and different items that you can forge. In order to build tiles and items you create with your crafting station, you will use energy as the primary resource. All right, so on the left-hand side, that is your energy. And on the right-hand side, those are called gears. So the gear are essentially what allow your heavy metal mecha bot to speed up its building process. Your heavy passively generates energy whenever it hovers over a tile. To generate more energy, click on the tile. You can upgrade it to a higher and higher level. You can upgrade the amount tiles. Of energy slow down your progress. From yeah, time your heavy time, metal isn't all that chalked up to be. It can excrete some uh, sludge and you gotta click it in order to clean it up. And also your heavy metal likes to be pet. It's like a pet guys. So if you click on it, you're petting it and it increases its mood. Everybody poops, including your heavy. From time to time, your heavy will have an accident, but it's easy to clean. Clicking it rapidly will get the job done. Just make sure to do so soon. Otherwise it will diminish the amount of energy your heavy gets. And last but not least, Hey, there's power ups the guys. Where you can buy useful power ups or premium blueprints. These items are are available to purchase using gears, which can be bought in-game with ApeCoin. Just follow the on-screen instructions to do so. The first goal you should focus on is connecting your home base to the nearest portal. Once you build to the portal, you will unlock another key feature, the leaderboard, where you can show off your forge to the world. All right, all right. And if you want a little explanation on how the leaderboard works. Heavies of every kind in different dimensions are vying for fame. Through the fame tab, a heavy can upvote or downvote another heavy's forge one time each subsequent vote cost more energy and the cost per vote resets new daily leaderboard which means the rankings you see are completely decided by the actions and influence of the community player base there are two leaderboards daily and seasonal the daily ranking shows you the highest voted forges of the day when the timer runs out your daily rank will grant you points based on your placement the second leaderboard is the season leaderboard each season lasts 
three weeks. After each three-week season, forges will be rewarded with an important upgrade called amps. Amps come in five possible rarities. The rarity of the amp you receive will be tied to your global rank. Amps are crucial for advancing your heavy to an EVO 2 in the future. You will need at least three amps of any rarity in order to unlock the next evolution when the time comes. Heavies need to participate at minimum one time building and forge during each three week period in order to receive that season's amp. You can only earn one amp per heavy per season. Want to check out another forge? You can search for them in the Fame tab. The all idea right, all right, we're gonna we're gonna go to my land or one of my lands. I got two bots right now, so um, this is the main screen, ladies and gentlemen. Forge.hv-mtl.com. Don't go to a uh, scam website. Uh, I guess Machi Big Brother. He delegated his heavy metals to a uh, gamer, and his gamer clicked a uh, phishing link, and he lost all of his heavy metals. Don't be like him. All right, connect your wallet. We're gonna go with MetaMask. Next, connect, sign in. Yep, and we get to start. Now we are on our land. As you can see, here is the forge button where you get to see what you get to build if you wanna build it. You don't have to. And that's a purple one. My theme right now is uh, these white slates and these grass slates. We'll, we'll get to building that in a little bit right now my little heavy metal bot is upgrading this tile and just like that video said if I wanted to speed up this process I could do so for nine gears so if I wanted to buy gears I would hit buy ApeCoin. ApeCoin is the crypto that is being used to buy your upgrades. You get the picture, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to speed up the process, you would go into this section. You would buy ApeCoin. You would use ApeCoin to buy your gear. Level up power up can increase your tile level. Wanna check it out in the shop? Or why not? Let's check it out. So just like that video explanation, you have power ups. This one is 54 gears. With this bonus, your heavy will gain double the energy when it travels through a portal. This one is 122. Your heavy will want pets, which gains you energy. Right now, my energy is full. I have built out to my second portal, and in order to activate the portal, I need to build 15 more tiles. And then just as I said that, my heavy metal took a shit. So this is how you clean up the shit. So let's build this tile, and I'll show you guys what that looks like. So in 20 seconds, this tile will be created. I'll be on my way. Let's see what else I got in store for us. Purple tile, next. White tile, maybe I'll go with that one. I'll keep it there. You can upgrade your tiles to generate more energy. The higher level your tiles are, the more energy your heavy will generate when moving over them. Looks like your forge has reached its energy capacity. It can't store more energy yet. Find an upgrade portal to increase your capacity. Telling me that like my energy right now is at 305,000 and I can't store anymore. If I wanted to store more, I would have to activate this portal, which needs 14 more tiles now. I want to show you guys what it looks like to delete a tile. Boom! I just destroyed that tile. And now my uh, my heavy wants some pets. So if I had less than 305,000, this would gain me energy. And it's also increasing my heavy metals mood, as you can see in the top left-hand corner. I want to build something for you guys. Hey, man, he just shits everywhere. You guys kind of get the picture. Hey, God, he freaking wants more pets. This is what you got to do. Keep him happy. So he builds faster and he stops shitting everywhere. We are going to vote for a land. Let's vote for my other one, 2021. We have already voted for it, so I cannot vote for it again. But hey, let's take a visit over to my other land. Hey, look, we're already there. All right, so this is just a preview of my other land. As you can see, I've got a nice little cow. Got a, a nice uh, computer, boxing glove, and a nice house and a nice mushroom. I haven't built out to my other portal yet. And apparently there's like three other portals in this gigantic portal. Again, I've only been playing this game for six days. Each season is three weeks. There's going to be six seasons. You're going to need to acquire those amps in in order to evolve your heavy metal to the second version. And I'm thinking you're gonna be having to fight off monsters as this game evolves into the later yep. seasons. Let's check out this thread by OX Cosmos. A lot of people today just starting their forge. Regardless of what you've heard, it's possible to catch up and pass a lot of people if you're using this optimal strategy for maximizing energy production early on. This guy is saying, do not connect all portals immediately. Otherwise, you will be left upgrading 
all of these tiles, which is going to take forever. If I wanted to upgrade one of my tiles, it would take, I think, about an hour. This tile is level 14. It's going to cost 114,000 energy if I wanted to upgrade it. If I wanted to upgrade this tile, it's level three, it's only 360. You can see as your tile increases its level, it requires more energy and it requires more time. Let's forge this one. Probably only take like two, three minutes. My mistake, 17 seconds. You can really exponentially grow in the beginning before you get to the point where I'm at where it takes an hour to upgrade any of these tiles and I haven't even reached the second portal yet. So there's a few different ways to play this game. I only built 10 tiles and I ranked all of them up as much as I could. So all these are either 14, 13, 15. I just reached uh, this second portal. So all these are rank one, rank two, three, so throughout the day today, I'm gonna to be ranking these tiles up. I'm gonna create more tiles so then I could increase the activation of this portal. One uh, little recommendation for Yuga. Can we turn off these notifications from Gary? They're kind of annoying. But uh, back to the thread. The first thing you wanna do is place 10 tiles, like I was just saying, and get to the first portal. As soon as you're done, you can now delete every tile, but four necessary to reach that portal. Focus on only these tiles, leveling them to 10 each. Should only take you a few hours. Ax this portal in, until you can't anymore. This will happen when the energy required to level this portal is more than you can store with a single portal. It's about 305K. Now go for the second portal, which is right above and only five tiles away. But you'll need 30 tiles to activate it, so you will want to build them, then delete 21 of them, and now you don't have to rank up all those tiles, which will take you hours and hours. Right, now all you wanna do is max these two portals before you're going for the third portal and level these tiles as needed. In a few days, you will have maxed these portals and only then you will connect to the third portal. That's just the gameplay. Now, if you wanna increase your rank and increase the rarity of your amps, you're going to want to engage with the community. Visit other people's builds and you can upvote them or you can downvote them. If you have some friends that are playing this game, I would trade votes with them. Or if you have no friends, then go on Twitter and start tweeting out your land because you can get Twitter votes. So you don't even have to own a heavy metal in order to get people to vote on your land. Real quick, more portals equals more tiles equals less average tile level equals weeks to max portal instead of days. Good luck and see you in the rift. And I'm gonna end this video off by saying, if you vote for my land, I'll leave this in the description, and you show me proof, you will be entered in a giveaway to win some ape coin. That's right guys, I'm gonna be giving away ape coin. You just have to show me proof. Look for my tweet later today. That's all I got. Be blessed. Taco out.